Dixon and I should be playing Andras. I was here last year, um, I was on ensemble in Philips cover Jean Paul Jean. Um, so it's really cool to be back in this capacity and stuff. And I know half the people already, which is it's quite a comfort actually starting mid contract and all that. So it's really nice because it makes me feel at ease and like yeah, it's really nice. But it's a part that I've always um, looked at and just been like, you're so cool man, look at you, like leading all these people, it's just got the best moment, for me it's got the best moments in the show, um, obviously I'm playing so I, I, I just, it's just epic, like his party comes on and he means business. Well obviously you're going to get people who have not necessarily ever been to a musical, um, come and see the show for the first time, so it's really nice to be a part of that other people's first experiences of Les Mis, because obviously it's been around for 27 years, um, and you've obviously got a huge following of fans that have been, you know, coming back and forth, and like, really dedicated fans, um, and now it's going to just create a whole new fan base, um, and it's really exciting to be a part of people's first experiences of Les Mis, so yeah, it's really exciting. Yeah, everything, no, uh, the barricades for me, um, because uh, it's just so gut wrenching me emotionally. When I watch the show, um, the bit that always, like, I've seen the show probably around six or seven times, um, and the bit without fail that always gets me is the barricades and then the big explosion and then suddenly all the slow motion and the students getting shot and like all this, this almost ballet-esque kind of deaths. And it's just, yeah, streaming down my face every time I see that bit. And it's just, I can't wait to be a part of that. Do you hear the people sing, singing the song?